Lesson 163. Salad, sandwich. So, salad is salad, and, and sandwich is sandwich because it's coming from the English sandwich. So, that's just a loan word borrowed from English. Yes, my idea is sandwich is coming from Lord of Sandwich, which are eyes <laughs> of, of northern UK. Yes. Not recently, but in past lessons, we've talked a lot about the partitive article. And here with salad, we could use the term salad. Like imagine you have just a huge bowl of salad and you just want some of it. Or imagine if it's a prepackaged salad. Could you take us through that and how you might use those two words in two different ways? Yes. Well, if you want some salad, you have to make the partition. But you want de la salad, a part of the salad. In the first example, we have, I want some salad with my dinner. Yes. So there we're going to say, de la salad. Yes. That's the partitive article. And when you want to buy your salad, so je vais au magasin pour acheter une salade. I, I think in that case, it's not exactly the same salad. It's like a pre -pack It's not a pre-packaged salad. It is the lettuce. It's called salad in French. Oh, oh okay. So what, it is also called lettuce. But all this green thing, you know, uh -huh. each one is a salad. So if, if so you, you want... So you would say une salad. Yes, une salad is one lettuce, for example. Okay. But if you, go to, if you go to Giant and you want some salad, you know, you can now buy uh, some tomato things plus mm -hmm. eggs or I don't know, then it is still de la salade. Because in that case, the salad is, is the, the dish that is prepared. I and see. there is no one salad that is a dish. It's a party. Yeah. Okay. But if you're at a dinner table with people and there's a huge bowl of salad and you just want someone to give you some of that, then you would use the partitive article. Yes.